Jason, wanted to ask about your recent news that Michael Jordan is going to be a special advisor to your board. What, what exactly does that mean? H how do you expect him to drive business? Your stock shot straight up just on the headline. You know, I think the thing that Michael may be even more impressive, although certainly pretty impressive what he did uh, on the court as an NBA player, um, but maybe even more impressive is what he's been able to do on the business side. Uh, I think he's created a fairly unique uh, brand and really has created an entire trend of how athletes are used to market. And we're excited that that you know, brand genius, that business acumen is something Michael's going to bring to the boardroom and really looking forward to learning from him. And I think a lot of if you look at what we're trying to create from a brand perspective, a lot of it is very similar to what Michael's been able to do. So hopefully we can soak up some of that knowledge from him and uh, you know, really build something special together. What about any potential conflict of interest? The fact that, that he is an MBA owner and, and now going to be a company insider. Have you, have you guys thought through how you're going to guarantee that there is no impropriety there? The fact that, that he's going to be, have very intimate knowledge of players and management of a team and, and also of your site, which gambles on those kinds of teams and players. Well, Mike, Michael will have nothing to do with the operations in terms of setting odds and things like that. He's going to be giving us general business advice, brand strategy, things like that. Um, he's not going to get into those sorts of things, nor will we ever ask him. And, you know, boards deal with this all the time. We have people from media companies in our boardroom. We have, uh, you know, a variety of different perspectives. And I think it's helpful as a company trying to figure out how to create a really complicated space that touches on a lot of different parts of the ecosystem really helpful to get those perspectives and of course you know if there's topics that need to be discussed that are not appropriate those people step out of the room and we're pretty used to that and uh, I don't expect it to be an issue here because like I said we don't really talk about those things uh, in the boardroom those are much more operational things and in the boardroom we're talking much more about strategy and uh, you know plans for the business.